So our engaged dog, we have all the motivation, we have movement is motivating, moving to get the dog's attention, transitioning to making the dog make us move with their attention. We have contrast, we have varying the duration of the reward event. We talked about length of session and all those things come together and we're gonna work engagement primarily by itself for a period of time before I worry about any behaviors. And this is one of the chief differences in the way that I approach dog training in, uh, now as opposed to when I learned dog training in the beginning. When I learned dog training in the beginning, you came in and you started teaching the dog a behavior. Day one, you put a dog on the leash and you showed him how to sit, and you showed him how to down, you showed him how to walk on the leash. Everything was focused on behavior right off the bat. What we're focused on is building those tools and engagement is the first piece of the puzzle that I'm getting the dog there and I'm gonna try to hold that dog's attention. You can absolutely use toys and things for engagement as well. So it is possible for dogs to, to build engagement and things through play too. The issue there is typically play is not very useful to us until we teach the dog how to play. And normally that takes some time. And so I'm normally doing my early engagement work with food while I take the time to teach my dog how to play. Because a toy as a tool for building engagement isn't very useful if my dog won't bring it back to me or let go of it or uh, d those things. I can't really functionally use it to reward in training. So I tend to play with my dogs on the side, which also tends to build engagement. Just taking your dog out and teaching them to play, they like that interaction. It makes them want to pay attention to you. It's relationship building. It's all those things, right? But it's not ready for prime time in terms of behavior creation and using it as a reward until I get some of the kinks ironed out. So it's its own thing, and then I'm doing my engagement sessions typically with food, right, at, at first. And then I have an engaged dog and we're ready to kind of dive into the training process.